morning, welcome to my beautiful mess. This is Mary, I wanna thank you for joining me today. Today I'm gonna to do a plan with me in my social media planner. Um, I'm using the dashboard layout and I'm using the social type uh, planner that came in the social type Be Happy box. So we're gonna get started. Today I'm basically using an, kind of an older sticker book. It's the Simply Lovely, it's been around for a while. This is one of my favorite sticker books. I mean, I love the color palette and I love the florals. If you've been following me for any amount of time, you know I'm big on florals, I love it. So today we're gonna to just start with that and I'm really only using the sticker book. Um, it's kind of been sitting around and I haven't used it in a while, so I'm really challenging myself to use some of these stickers and, you know, use up this book. So, and you know, don't be afraid of using your stickers, y'all. Like this, I said, this is one of my favorites. Don't sit on your stickers, use them. You can always go buy another book. So I'm gonna start, um, if y'all have watched me for a while, you know, I love using these, um, these kind of sticker box, you know, these sticker boxes, and this one's a layered one, but you know, typically these kind of boxes are meant for uh, your vertical layout, but I love using these horizontally. <laughs> I know I'm strange, but um, you know, depending on the design, I'm, I think they're really good for using horizontally. And in the dashboard, they actually look really pretty when you put them, um, sorry, when you put them this way, like horizontally, you can see. Um, but it fits just it fits just as well in um, in the dashboard layout. So I'm gonna do that, and I'm going to add a border here. And I'm going to cover up um, this kind of checklist here just because. I don't really like the way it kind of doesn't, like it doesn't go with my, <laughs> it doesn't, it's not, this isn't a neutral planner, y'all. This is a very colorful planner. And the downside to that is just that, you know, if you're doing a design that looks very, um, has like a very clear color palette, that it's not always, um, not always the best, but that's okay. We're just gonna cover it up. So as best as we can anyway, right? So I'm just going to cover that up as good as I can. And let's see here. I have, still have like a little space that, um, that kind of needs some, some covering up. So I'm just gonna use one of these cute little XO stickers and just kind of Cover that little space up. There you go, all done. And one nice thing about the Simply Lovely um, sticker book is that it has, it actually has a lot of stickers that are perfect for the dashboard layout. Like there's plenty of vertical stickers, you know, for the vertical layout, but it actually has several, like quite a few of these like dashboard layout kind of um, stickers that are just perfect for this layout. So I'm gonna add that there. And I'm just going to cover up, I have this little section here that says errands. And you know, this is my social media planner. I use this for my blog and I use this for uh, my YouTube channel and Instagram and my Etsy store and all that kind of stuff. So I don't really need errands. So I'm just gonna kind of cover that up there. And then I'm going to use another checklist and just kind of cover up that space as well. It's a little crooked. And I'm just going to add this to one of my days. This is what I mean about it being kind of perfect for the dashboard. It has some of these stickers that really work well with this. Um, design. And I'm just going to kind of leave that up a little bit because, and you know what, while I'm at it, I notice that I have still like a little bit of a gap 
right around here. So I think I'm just gonna kinda cover that up a little bit like that. Okay. And the reason why I kind of left this folded up um, is just because I like to sometimes layer some stickers underneath it. Like, I like kind of layering florals underneath that kind of space like that. That's really cute. And I'm going to use one of these bigger clear stickers and kind of do something similar, except I'm going to use some circle stickers to kind of add a little more interest. So I'm gonna just lay this right here like this. I'm gonna let it overlap on the border a little bit. And then I have found some pretty like circle stickers in the sticker book, and I'm just gonna layer that on top. Because I think when you layer, that adds like a lot more interest to the page. Okay, easy, easy. And I'm just going to add that here. And I'm going to cover up my 2020 that's up here. Just because I prefer not to see it. Okay. I prefer to kind of get rid of all, as much of this color scheme as I possibly can. And the last thing I need is something to cover up. You know what, I might actually add a couple of um, bullet points here. So anyway, the, what I was gonna say was, the last thing that I need is to cover up these um, dinner plans um, space that's over the Monday through Sunday um, uh, list there. I'm sorry, I'm, th I'm like thinking and I'm trying to find something at the same time that, um, that'll cover that up. And, you know, in the sticker book, there really aren't a lot of um, colorful boxes that are kind of horizontal, if that makes sense. Um, like they have some colorful boxes in here, but they're not like, I may have already used them in, in fairness. Um, but since I can't really like find anything in the sticker book, um, I'm going to end up just kind of using, um, I think like a little, you know, I don't even know that this is going to, I was going to use one of these and I'm like, I don't even know that that's going <laughs> to gonna totally cover it up you know what it kind of doesn't I think I'm just going to do it anyway and oops I'm not far enough over so I'm gonna try to cover that up as much as possible and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back and just add another one on top. Um, I'm, you know, I don't really need to label this in any way because the truth is, is that I always use this section for my Instagram. So I actually know like what I'm gonna use this Monday through Sunday for. So I'm just gonna kind of double up on some stickers there and cover that space up. And that's pretty much it. Um, that is the Simply Lovely in the dashboard, um, one of my favorite sticker books. And there's some blue tones in the sticker book as well, but I decided not to use it. I just used pink and black um, and then the green because I think it's really pretty together and very striking. So I want to thank you for watching. Thanks so much for joining me. Um, I do videos every Sunday and every Thursday, so thank you for tuning in. There's always new content on this channel before you leave. I would love it if you gave me a thumbs up for this video, and then please subscribe before you leave.